Hey, it's Des, and I'm currently doing take five of my intro to this room tour video. As you can tell, there is no intro to this video because you know I'm going to be doing one for the new year. Yeah. Well, I'm here with a room tour video, the long-awaited room tour because I was supposed to do one maybe two months ago, and I'm very completely, deeply sorry for that because I just wasn't in love with my bedroom as I am now. So, yeah. I hope you guys enjoy this video. And Sage is outside with my mom. I was watching him while I do this video. And then you see my vanity. And there's me. So anyways, you see my vanity. You see all my makeup, like all of my palettes are there. I don't have enough space in my vanity. Like all this is filled with palettes already. So then you see John's snake skin. And you come over here and you see my lovely Mandela along with Polaroid pictures which I'll zoom in that in a minute but it says sage up there and it's this beautiful sunset because I love the sunset I'm sorry about the kids screaming out there there's um I don't know what the hell they're doing Yes, that is Sage's bumpkin, which there's nothing showing but his butt. So I'm going to show y'all the second row. see Sage's dirty clothes, a gift I just got yesterday from John's Thea, and then Sage's other basket filled with clothes, and then another basket filled with clothes, and then Sage's diaper bag. This diaper bag does say Sage Reyes on there, and then a bag full of all of his Christmas toys. Like, there was a lot of them, so I had to put them in a big bag. And then you come up here, that's Sage's giraffe. These are where my paintings are gonna go. I did paint that for John on his birthday, which I did make him a cake, and I did a bunch of other stuff with a poster. I thought it was really cute. You go up here, and I painted two other paintings. So then after that, you see mine and John's graduations. And you see the pictures of me and John up there. You see my white curtain, which I still have canvases that I'm working on that are going to go right there. And then I have picture frames right there. And then these are canvases I also did paint. And then lots of pictures of me and John. So these are all before Sage. That was actually my sweet 16. Picture of me and John. That was me before I had a baby. Picture of my lovely fiance. John's favorite picture. 
the, before the mom bod. <laughs> But after that, you see my sunflower curtains back down here. That's a bunch of uh, Polaroid pictures of Sage when he was first born in Sage's bottle. So I have my candle, my fake flowers, and right here is just Sage's teethers, his pacifiers, the glass rose that John gave me, and this is from the Christmas present John gave me as well. But, you know, just like basically important stuff, like his ointments are in there, his ore gel, yeah. And then my Polaroid camera, and two pictures, and then my Paris lamp that my mom bought me a while back. Say so just simple pillow. <laughs> then you come right here and you see say so just cute little outfit that he still hasn't worn. And then all of these uh, photo booth pictures that me and John have taken which is those two right here before Sage, which I was pregnant with Sage right there. I was like 11 weeks pregnant. And then this was recently. And then you see my other mirror, which I'm actually wanting to get rid of this mirror, but yeah. My Victoria's Secret sweater, my pink uh, bag, and you see my boots. All of these are heel boots, except those are cowgirl boots. And then you see my red heels, my house shoes. And then you come right here and you see all my other shoes are stuffed in there. And then you come right here and this is like my drawer, my side. And then there's some flowers and then you see our TV. We'll go back to that in a minute. So then you see my mini bombshells, you already know. You see my other Victoria's Secret. I have a lot more sprays, but they don't all fit in my room, so they're in storage right now. And a picture of my lovely, handsome man. And then a picture of me and baby boy, my other handsome man. And then I've got brushes in here, and then this is just empty. It's just a cute little kiss bag. And then these are actually for the bombshells. So that's just one of my dream catchers. Then right here, I always do this every month for my son. It's just kind of like a milestone thing. And you know, like this month he's 19 pounds. His sleeping patterns, he would wake up once or twice for a bottle, but when he was sick, he would just wouldn't sleep at all. He's 28 inches going on nine inches. And there's a picture of me and him right there of this month. Then I put gets on hands and knees and rocks back and forth because you know, like. That's just one of his other milestones. And then these are other little milestones where he creeps. He's got a second tooth, which I actually found out in this month, so I don't really know how long he had his second tooth. And then he did sit in the height chair this month. Like he sits in it more now than he did last month. Like last month he sat in it, but he doesn't sit in it like he does now. And his six months. And then this is our countdown and then his Christmas, and then I just put a little side note so baby boy got a lot of presents, which he did. And then he was fussy yesterday, very fussy, and then it says New Year's Eve, baby's first. So then I here have a bunch of clothes because, you know, it doesn't fit all in my dresser. And then a trash can and then a heater. So yeah, I actually got this from my baby shower. And it says even superheroes need to take a nap. So you come right here, y'all already know this is my old intro, but these are just pictures. I don't know if y'all can see that, it's very dark. It's a picture of me and John kissing, and a picture of me and him, like these are really old. Another one, then the very first picture we ever took, and then that was us holding hands. And I'm sure y'all remember these pictures, but I'll go ahead and show them to the ones that don't. And then this is a dream catcher my grandma gave me and I absolutely am in love with it. I'll probably take it to my grave, honestly. Then, since we're up here already, I have a white wolf. 
on my ceiling. My mom actually bought me this chandelier and I didn't think she was actually gonna buy it. I had was just joking around because she asked me what I wanted for my 18th birthday and I told her chandelier. This woman bought it for me. I have more pictures. I have this picture frame my grandma did for me on my 18th birthday. That is really sweet and cute. Then I had this from my baby shower as well. This is all because two people got in love. Then I have this like antique light switch that John brought home when he was at work. And then my trick keys. And then we have our big TV. We have our Xbox. We have popcorn we got from Christmas, Sage's water, my other house shoes. And then these are just random pictures that we just had like laying around. Like Sage fell asleep like that. I thought it was cute. And then that was from the baby shower. Um, John's mom got it from somebody that made it and said dad to be. John's little robot. Mine and John's present that we got for Christmas. I had an Ulta card and then there was money in there. Then my water speakers are right behind the TV. And then we have like little trash bags for whenever Sage poops and stuff like that so it doesn't like smell. Trash bags actually smell like uh, baby powder. And then on my door, I do have like a little rack hanging and this is the pink scarf that I did get from my mother-in-law. I have not used it yet. I was actually thinking about using it tonight since tonight is New Year's. Then my Victoria's Secret bag. I'm freaking in love with it. I cannot wait to use it. Well, this is our bedroom. This is my room, guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this room tour. Sorry that it's like very late, but I promise with the next room tour that I do do that it will be on time. Thank you so much for watching. Subscribe down below if you like this video or if you want to see future videos like this. I'm very flushed, which means I'm hot and my cheeks are red. Um, I hope everybody has a wonderful New Year's and a happy New Year's Eve. I hope this year brings lots of blessings and positivity because that is what we're aiming for. And now I'm going to go attend to my baby because he keeps crying. Bye, guys.